Google Workspace tutorial how to use Google Workspace. With this tutorial, you'll learn how to maximize the features of Google Workspace to work smarter and not from creating documents and spreadsheets to organizing your calendar. We have got you covered. Google Workspace is a flexible, innovative solution for people and organization to achieve more. Google Workspace is provided by Google and has all the tools that we need. It includes Gmail, Google Meet, Google Chat, Google Calendar, Google Drive, Docs, Sheets, Slides, Forms, Google Sites, Keep, Apps Script, Cloud Search, and Jamboard. So all of these apps are available in one hub Google Workspace. Pricing Plan On Google Workspace, we have a pricing plan available. There is a business starter for just $6 per user per month and then we have a business standard which is going to be $12 per user per month. And then we have a business plus for $18 per user per month and an enterprise which is going to be custom features for custom pricing. The most popular plan with Google Workspace is the business standard one which is just $12 per month. You can actually use the link given in the description down below to get started. So this way you will directly get to the link and you will be able to get your own dashboard. Uh, with this plan you can get customs and secure business email, 150 plus participants, 2 TB of storage and more. Once you get right here, in order to get started and to create a business email, you will click on get started. So here we have to enter our business name, number of employees, here you will enter the number of employees and then you're gonna select your region. Click on next. Now you have to get started with Google Workspace. Enter your first name, last name and current email address. Click on next. And now we will connect our domain to Google Workspace. We have two options when it comes to connecting our domain. If you already have one, you can just select, yes, I have one and I can use. And then if you wanna buy a domain name with Google Workspace, then you can select this option. So we can actually buy a domain with Google Workspace and we can even create in a business email so i'm gonna actually show you both of these options first yes i have one this is where you will enter your domain name for instance i have this domain name right here now we will click on next use this domain to set up an account click on next and this is going to be your domain that you have connected to your google workspace if you want to buy a domain name then you can select i want to buy and it will allow you to search from different domain names available let's say i'm looking for a domain name now so I'll just enter the desired domain that I want. So we have different types of domain. We have .com, .net, .org, and .info. So let's search for .com and we're going to hit search and it will give me the prices and it will show me if it's available or not. So you can see the .com, .net, and .info are unavailable. You can see right here and then we have different prices for different domains here. The prices are not that expensive. You will be able to get a domain on Google Workspace for $12 per year, $11 per year, even $8 per year. So it depends on you what domain you want. Of course, some of the domains are going to be a little expensive, such as .co is $30 and then we have .io for $60 per year. But you can connect any domain from here. You select the domain. It will allow you. So once you select, it will give you the domain and now you can click on next and you will be able to connect it. Now we have to enter our business info. This is personal. You can just enter your street name, street address, city, state, zip code and a business phone number and then click on next. Once you enter your business info, then you have to set up a username. You can see each username will have a business email at your company name dot me. This is the domain that we connected. It will set up a password, select the recapture click on agree and continue after that once you click on next your google workspace will be created and you will have your own account with google workspace you will be able to connect create and collaborate with google workspace you will be getting your own business gmail so you can convert your simple at gmail.com into a company name at com and you will be able to actually connect a domain name and have a business email for your business or any work that you're doing with your gmail you will be getting more 
options, of course, you can create spaces and you will also be able to connect your Google Meet to your Gmail. When it comes to Google Chats, we will be able to create groups here too and spaces. You'll be able to collaborate and connect with your team really easily. You will be able to invite team members and even create meetings with them. With Google Workspace, you will not only be getting the Gmail or the chats, you can also create documents within your Google Workspace and then use these documents in your events, in emails, during your meetings and upload on Drive too. You can create high quality professional forms with Google Forms that, that is included in Google Workspace. We also have our spreadsheets. You will be able to create sheets that are collaborative and designed with the needs of agile organizations in mind. With Google Workspace, we can also access Google Drive, where we can store, access, and share our files in a secure place. With a drive, you will be getting your storage capacity that you need. It will be increased. You will be able to search for different files and documents in real time. You can organize team files in a shared space. Use less of your PC, Mac, disk space and stream directly from the cloud. And then, of course, we have our Google Calendar. A Google Calendar helps you spend less time planning and more time doing. With a shareable um, a calendar view, you will be able to work across your Google Workspace. You can actually create events. You can schedule your emails. You can schedule your meetings with uh, Google Meets. You can create your form. So Google Calendar is actually one of the most important apps on uh, Google, and we get it inside our Google Workspace. Uh, your plans will be at your fingertips you will be able to create a to-do list you can add a task set a due date and check it off too uh, you will be able to schedule your meetings and you can do this in multiple calendars and uh, different views too you can access all of these amazing apps within google workspace you can get started as i showed you step by step and you can click on the link given in the description down below it will directly take you to the signing up process and you will be able to uh, create a business email get started with google workspace and also verify your domain name if this video was a value to you give it a big thumbs up and subscribe to youtube channel and don't forget to watch how to create google forms